and Dizzy and Rolly too. Lofty and Wendy join the crew. Bob and the gang have so much fun. Working together, they get the job done. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can. Bilchard and Bird, Travis and Spud, playing together like good friends should. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can. Today, Bob. I'm building a hen coop for Farmer Pickles. What's a hen coop, Bob? It's a little wooden shed for hens to sleep in. Farmer Pickles wants one to keep his chicks safe and snug. Ooh, has Farmer Pickles got some chicks? Not yet, Dizzy, but he's expecting his hen to lay her eggs any time now. What's that for, Wendy? It's roofing felt, Dizzy, to cover the roof and keep the rain out. <laughs> That's a good idea. The chicks won't want to get their feathers wet. All set, Muck. Uh, yes, yes, Bob. Can you build it? Yes, yes we, we can. Bye, Muck. Oh, no. Hens go into their coops during the day, Bob. Well, they can go in whenever they want to, Muck. It's a nice warm place for the hen to sit on her eggs. Sit on her eggs? <laughs> won't, won't she squash them? No. She just keeps them warm until they're ready to hatch out. Um, Bob, how will the chickens get into the hen coop? Well, that's easy. I'll put two doors in and make little ramps so they can run up and down. Oh, you are clever, Bob. <laughs> Thanks, Muck. Scruffy, come here. What have you found, Scruffy? Oh no, the hens laid her eggs under the hedge, and now she's gone off and left them. Well, we can't stand around here looking for her. The eggs will get cold. Come on, Scruffy. We've got to keep them warm until they hatch out. There we are, Muck. All we need now is the roofing felt to cover the coop. OK, Bob. Hello, Farmer Pickles. What have you got there? Oh, eggs, Bob. My hen wandered off after she laid them. I've been trying to keep them warm under this straw. <laughs> they look nice and snug. Oh, I must try and find the hen, Bob. Could you keep an eye on these while Scruffy and I go and look for her? No problem, Farmer Pickles. Muck can keep the eggs safe in his digger. Ah! How do I look after eggs? It's easy, Muck. Just keep very still. Oh, OK, Bob. <laughs> oh, that cockerel's been crowing all morning. I know, Spud. I can't stand it any longer. I'm going to find Farmer Pickles and see if he can make him stop. Good idea, Spud. Oh, there's not enough felt to cover the whole roof. We'll have to go back to the yard for another roll. But, but, but what about the eggs, Bob? They, they might break on the way. You're right, Muck. We'd better leave them here. But we need someone to look after the eggs while we're gone. Farmer Pickles! Farmer Pickles! Oh, hi, Bob. Spud, you're just in time to do a little job for me. <laughs> Bob said we had to keep the eggs nice and warm. Well, this load of old straw is not much good. Ha! Look, Travis, Farmer Pickles' duvet. That's just what we need to keep the eggs warm. But won't Farmer Pickles mind you using it? Oh, don't be silly, Travis. Of course he won't. Spud, watch out! Oh! Oh, oh. 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 oh dear. That's torn it. <coughs> <laughs> now you look like a chicken, Spud. Look, Travis! One of, one of the eggs is, is hatching. Ha <laughs> ha, Spud. The chick thinks you're its mum. Hello, little chicken. 
you, you just settle down. I'll, I'll keep you nice and warm until your mum gets back. Yes, um... Spurge! Shush, Travis, you'll, you'll wake the little chick. What are we going to do with the eggs that haven't hatched out? I'll, I'll look after them, Travis. I'll, I'll take very good care of them and ev everything and... Spud, isn't the mother supposed to look after the chicks? Yes, but I, I don't mind looking after them until she gets back. I, I, I could stay here all day. <laughs> Sleepy bye-byes. Oh, it's no good, Scruffy. The hen's not under there. Oh, where could she have gone? Oh, hold on, Scruffy. Wait for me. Right, let's get this hen coop finished. Shush, Bob. You wake them up. What are you talking about, Travis? Spud thinks he's a hen. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> well, he does look like a chicken. <laughs> I think we'd better let them sleep. <laughs> Stop, Bob. Huh? The hammering will wake up the chick. Oh, you're right, Travis. But how am I going to finish the hen coop? Can't you hammer the nail in quietly, Bob? <laughs> well, I can try. I didn't wake the chick. Oh, uh, oh, 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 hi, Bob. Look, one of the eggs has hatched out. You've done really well, Spud. Though I'm not sure what Farmer Pickles will say when he sees his duvet. You did tell me to keep the eggs warm, Bob. <laughs> yes, I did, Spud. Well, the hen coop's finished now, so we can put the eggs inside. There we are. <laughs> Look, Bob, I found the mother hen. You're just in time, Farmer Pickles. Spud's been looking after one of the chicks, and I think he needs a rest. Go on now, little chicky. Yes, it's been nice looking after you, but... Your real mum's waiting for you now, in the coop. Off, off you go. No, go on. Oh, look! The other eggs have hatched out. And I can see your chick, Spud. It's snuggled up with its mum and all its brothers and sisters. Oh, that's nice, Bob. <laughs> I wonder where their dad is. Well, well, here he comes now. What? That noisy old cockerel's the dad? Oi, you! You should have been here looking after your chicks instead of leaving it all to me. Get off! I'm not a hen! Oh dear, Spud! You certainly have a way with chickens! He's a cock-a-doodle, Scarecrow! <laughs> Spud's on the job! 